back to my channel, it's me, Addison. Hi, how are you guys doing? Uh, if you're new here, I post Milso, or I'm going to start posting Milso stuff. I um, post beauty, lifestyle, cleaning videos are a big thing I do. Do some tags here and there. Um, but yeah, so today I have decided that I want to dye my hair. So it's going to be a dye my hair with me video. And I already know I'm going to get a lot of like backlash for this because I'm using box dye or whatever but just for some background my mom has been a hairstylist for 30 something years and I don't use the developer oh, I just hit pearl in the head I'm so sorry uh, I don't use the developer in the boxes I use either a 10 or a 20 volume from Sally's and I don't do the little like squeezy tubes anymore because I they're really annoying and I can never cover my whole head with it um as you can tell well, you can't really tell. The top of my head right now is a completely different color than the bottom of my hair because I got bored one night and decided I wanted to ombre it. So I've washed my hair this morning, but it's like orangey and I'm kind of like over it and it doesn't blend how I really want it to. And I don't know, I started the ombre really high. So I'm gonna go ahead and dye my hair using the dye out of the Garnier, 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 I don't know how to say it, uh, Nutrice, and this is, what is this one? This is Color 500 Glazed Walnut. I have had dark hair before. If you go through my videos, you can see the, like, change of my hair, and I'm gonna use a 10 volume, because why not? And I'm just gonna use this little bowl I have from Sally's and this little brush. And I actually have like a cape because I don't like getting it all over my clothes, obviously. And I really like this shirt. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab that and then I will come back when we start mixing. Also, by the way, the reason the lighting kind of sucks is because I usually film in the day, but it's currently like 6 p.m. That's why I kind of look like a mess and like I really didn't want to do a makeup today, you know, when you have those days. So yeah, I went ahead and I grabbed my brush and I now obviously look like a rose gold potato, um, baked potato actually, but you know the ones where you uh, roll them in like aluminum foil, yeah. That's what I currently look like. And I grabbed a little clippy and some tea because I'm gonna be here for a while. Um, so I figured we would open up the box and kind of see what you can get. Obviously, if you've dyed your hair before, you kind of know what's in these things. But what I do is I use half the tube of color, usually. Um, depending on how like dark or whatever, how much hair I have and how I'm bringing it down. And then I mix it in with like, it's usually it's one to two. So it's one part volume or one part color and two parts, um, whatever that's called, uh, developer. So it comes with It comes with instructions, obviously. Uh, it tells you to do like a skin test to make sure that like you're not allergic to it. It comes with some gloves, which is very handy. And then it's just applying. So it tells you how to prep and mix it. Um, I'm not gonna use that, so yeah. Just because, why not? Uh, I usually also have like this little stick I got from Sally's and it, goes around like your face to make sure you don't get color in it, but like I don't care. Please don't tear up that boy I just bought. Don't tear it up, please. She likes to like rip them apart. So yeah, I'm just gonna grab my bowl. You can't really see what's in here, so I'm gonna try and film so you can kind of see, ignore the mess on my coffee table. But yeah, oh, I forgot my mirror. I'm gonna go grab that. So I don't know if you guys can see, but in here there's a little line. Sorry, that's just dust from, I washed it in the dishwasher. I'm too lazy to go clean it out and it's from the bleach. So like the bleach that I, I bleached my hair not too long ago. Um, so I'm just gonna fill it up to this line and then I'll do it up to here with the color. 
And yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and flip you guys back around so you can see me pouring it in. And then if you wanna see me mix it, it's not that exciting. So I figured you guys, if you have done anything with your hair would kind of know this. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and flip the uh, camera around and move. I forgot to film before I started doing this. But anyway, I filled it up, the developer up to the 10 or like the little, the first line. And then I went ahead and started doing this and I read to see what I'm doing and that's still sketchy. But, um, yeah, so I was reading the instructions and I'm blocking my face, but I use about half of the color and then I'll go ahead and add the other half if I need to. So that's about half. Um, I was gonna do an ombre, but I don't know if I'm gonna do that now. Honestly, I may just use the entire thing because like, I'm just gonna use the entire like thing because why not? I've applied direct color onto my head before, so this can't be any worse. I say like my mom, my mom's been in um, counsel or not counseling, <laughs> hairstyling for like 30 something years. That doesn't mean I've done anything like how it should be done. I've been dyeing my own hair since like high school. Which I mean like, not high school, maybe right after, I moved out at 18, so like right after I moved out I started dyeing my hair. And I went to a very small private Christian school where I couldn't, dye, like I could dye my hair, but I couldn't like do any fun colors. So like I did like red at one point and then, um, yeah, so. I guess I shouldn't mix it before I start doing anything. So I just like to hold the thing, the bowl, not the thing, and I kind of just like swirl it. You're supposed to like use the developer, obviously that's in there, not because it does literally anything different, but it's just in a squeezy tube and shaking it makes it so much easier. I don't know what I'm doing. It smells good though, it doesn't smell chemically, so that's nice, I guess. Austin's currently out at like a going away party for um, one of his old sergeants and, or something like that. Someone, one of his friends is, I don't know what they're doing. It's like a party or a get together or whatever, going away, something or other. Um, yeah, for one of his old sergeants and I'm by myself and I don't know why I ever, I, I'm just gonna part my hair in half or like whatever. And I use a little clippy do just to split it. And then I try and get as close to my head as I, whoa. Oh goodness, sorry. <laughs> the TV went out. Uh, that's my source of lighting. I think I've said that, but um, yeah, he's at a going away party thing and he every time he leaves me for like more than 30 minutes, I dye my hair and that's not a good thing, but like, here we are. So I'm just gonna run the brush through my hair, like so, just to uh, try and get out. See, you can take, like see where it's super like, uneven so I'm gonna try and fix that today and I bought the same exact ombre kit that I did the last time that I did this and um I'm gonna try and fix it maybe not tonight I may let my I currently have it all 
over my face and I'm sorry for that little glitch someone started calling me but yeah um I'm probably gonna have to go back and get some more I'm not too particular on how my hair is because I'm gonna end up putting bleach on like over half of it anyway um but yeah so I'll check in with you guys when this is finished I came into my kitchen because better lighting and stuff but I rinsed out my hair and this is kind of what the outcome is. It's a lot of different colors at the moment, but it is brown and I decided to go back to my brunette. See, as you can see, there's like some blonde poking through, but honestly, I don't mind it too much. I think it looks cool and like, I'm probably gonna redo it. That's my scalp. <laughs> I'm gonna redo it, um, but I'm decided that I'm gonna give my hair a break tonight just because I don't want to do too much damage to it, and I have to go get another box of brown just to like fix certain areas or whatever, but yeah, so that's going to be the end of this video because I have to go wash camis that I totally forgot about. Um, yeah, so I will see you guys in my next video, and thank you so much for watching. Please remember to hit that subscribe button, and yeah, so have a wonderful weekend i hope your weekend was fantastic and ignore the blonde right here because that will go away by the next time you see me anyway thank you again for watching and i will see you in my next video